going on guys coach attack here back with another vid today i got this google small and mighty i like to call it small and naughty product <laughs> so basically what this is is it re it's replacing it's it, it's comp to be honest it's competing with the amazon echo so it's a small version of the google home now this is the google home if you guys never saw google home this is how it looks it's tall personally it looks ugly but that's just me. All right, so what it basically does the same exact thing as the Google Home. It, you can see pair with Nest, YouTube, Hugh Phillips, Hugh Lights, which I have. What else? Netflix, Google Photos, Wemo, a bunch of cool stuff. Now it retails for 50 bucks. It comes in black, white, and red. Now off the bat, I'll tell you this, it already has that mesh finish. Now if you're sub to my channel, if you saw my videos, you know I don't like mesh products. You know, the magnitude particles they always get dusty, you always got to clean them up. It's not a clean finish. Now, what the Echo and the Dot, the Echo and the Dot have that nice uh, grill. So that's, you know, that's pretty nice. You never have to, it doesn't get dirty like these freaking, um, these mesh products. Okay. So let's check this out. Now, automatically, oh, never mind, just fell out. Wow, this thing's tiny. It's like a hockey puck. <laughs> well, it's actually a little bigger than a hockey puck. What am I saying? <laughs> but it's pretty cool. It's pretty small. All right. So we have the booklets. Uh, now this is the wire. Okay. This is the wire. And inside. Damn, I'm like. It's like a war in here. I think that's it. To be honest with you guys. I hope I took everything out the box. But this little guy's the hockey puck. It's tiny. Now, as I mentioned, you know, it does have this mesh, man. I'm just not a fan of this mesh stuff. Just not a fan. You have your power source here. Give your USB. Now, it's pretty simple. You have your mic option in the back to so turn the mic on and turn the mic off. It's here, and you have your power source. Your USB, micro USB, and then you have, what's this, a reset button? Yeah, you have a reset button here in the bottom as well. So, yeah, it's pretty cool. But yeah, I mean, yeah, look, whatever, 50 bucks, I said, you know, I'm just gonna Best Buy and just get it. 50 bucks, let me play around with it. Let me see, bring it to you guys, what I think of it. It has this nice rubber texture in the bottom, so it's not gonna slide. So if you have it on a good service, it's just gonna stick to the bottom. It's not gonna slide. You have that cool little G logo. Ooh, yeah, G, Google, Google. <laughs> but yeah, that's basically it. How, how does it compare to the home? Look at that. Voila, as you guys can see. Yeah, it's pretty, t much taller, much smaller. And look, it's they're competing with Amazon Echo, uh, Amazon, uh, with Amazon's Echo and Dot. So this is the Dot. You could say this is the Echo. I mean, it's basically, basically the same. But the cool thing actually with the Google Home is you have this, this on and off mic here instead of having a switch, which to be honest with you, I don't, I don't know. Just constantly like switching it on and off to turn your mic off. I wish this just made a button. Like right here we have the, where's this little reset button? But obviously make it bigger. Or the same thing as this. You know, just make a nice big button. I'll, I would say this, that the texture on the on the bottom compared to the to these guys, the, the mini has a much better texture, so it's not gonna slide. Now I have a table skirt on it, so it's not gonna work here, but but yeah guys, um, I am gonna do a full review about the Google Home Mini, but just yeah, just to compare the size difference, you know, that's it, but hey, like the video hit the like button subscribe guys always keep a coach tech i'll see you next time deuces